Okay, my day just took a good turn. Um, I was literally just leaving to go and get the bus for hockey on my own because I couldn't find any to take my second ticket. And um, I was in the post room checking my post when my friend announced that she'd like to come with me, which means I get a lift instead of the bus. And in the post room, I found my Tam Beauty parcel, which I'm very carefully keeping this way around to hide my address, even though when I give people my address, they can't always find it. So I'm going to bust this open and we're going to see what I bought. Uh. <laughs> right, so I feel like I should declare first of all that I bought some things and there was an offer on if you spent a certain amount you got a free mystery bag worth £25 and this will be the mystery bag. Oh, it's actually labeled mystery bag. I'm going to open that last. I'm going to show you what I bought first of all. Um, I'm really excited about some of this stuff. So. Um, and there is something for the giveaway in here, um, whenever the giveaway happens. <laughs> I'm just being organised, which is very unlike me. Oh, I should have got scissors. Okay, so first of all, I'm going to say there's so much bubble wrap in here, which I really appreciate because I bought a couple of palettes. In fact, I think almost everything I bought is powder, if not everything. So that's really good that it's very securely packaged. So, it's so securely packaged I can't get it out. <laughs> Let's try another side. Okay, we're now, now we're there. Now we're getting there. Okay. In fact, yeah, I bought three palettes and then two other things. Okay, let's start with the smaller palettes first. Um, so I bought two of these guys, which I remember as being £4 each. I've got Mermaids vs Unicorns, which is lots of kind of sea greeny aqua colours going into some purples and sparkly colours. And I also got Unicorns Are Real, which I thought was a really interesting mix for a palette because you've got these really light pastel colours. Um, then going into some, um, you know, we've got a bit of pink, a bit of purple, and then there's these kind of warm, this warm red colour, which I've seen swatches of online and it looked really interesting. And I'm just going to bust this open and show you guys it. Um, uh, so these are very well sealed, which again, I appreciate, um, especially when you're looking at this brand in the shop. It's good to know that nobody's been touching it. So come on, open for me. Um, as ever, it's got these little sponge applicators, which I never use. I used to, but not anymore. And at this end, you've got just this couple of natural colours. But this rusty colour, this is what I thought was like a really interesting shade that you don't see that often, especially in the drugstore. And just from that swatch, these are so soft and creamy. And that's going to be a gorgeous, gorgeous highlight colour. Um, what else do we have? Let's have this violety one. Oh, it's a very blue violet. Um, this was this guy, um, which looks more purple in real life than it does on camera, but then blue when I swatch it. So, camera is telling the truth. What else will we have? Let's go for the brownish one at the end. Oh yeah. So across the board, this seems really pigmented. But I will have a proper, proper play around later um, and try not to end up swatching everything in this haul. And I mean, this just speaks for itself. This is just like all my favourite colours. So those are £4 each, which, especially now that I've touched them, I think is an amazing price. But I'll have a play around with them. Maybe do a get ready with me with them. But really, I want you to do a get ready with me with this guy. This was £15. This is their Pro Artist Extreme Vice. I love me some leopard print. Um, so let's bust this guy open. Again, very well sealed. Why didn't I bring scissors to do an unboxing? I need to learn better. I always think my nails are going to do it and they're just not. Ta so as you can see, this is quite a large palette. Um, and you know, it's got a nice, pardon me, I've been drinking too much fizzy juice. Um, so it's got an elastic around it so that it's kept shut. 
and then this lid kind of has a bit of fold on it so that you can kind of stand your mirror up a bit more. Um, but let's talk about the colours because this just covers everything. Um, I particularly wanted to touch this lime green which I'm now going to because Oh. oh yeah, my finger was dirty, that was a bad plan. Let's try that again. These, if anything, feel even softer than the other ones and that is going to be such a fun colour to play with. Um, and let's try a purple because purples are usually... I'm just going to switch hands now because my fingers are too dirty. Oh yeah, that that is gorgeous, I'm so excited. We've got like an olivey green. Ah, I have no primer on, by the way. Um, a kind of burnt orange, which is going to be a really interesting colour again. Especially with blue eyes, that's going to pop like nobody's business. And let's have one more. We have a beautiful shimmery aqua blue. So this, I just think, has such a range of colours. It's amazing always sold out in super drug stores when I go in so I just had to grab it while I was online so so excited oh can't wait to do my makeup tomorrow um, and yeah this feels like a really sturdy palette so I'm really happy with that and then last but certainly not least is a very internet hyped product which I have two of I'm gonna have to do um, a full review of this and hopefully it is as good as everybody says because I bought a second one to put in the giveaway and this is the Unicorn Heart Rainbow Highlighter. Now this is shrink wrapped which really makes me wish I had scissors um, and I can't get my nails into it. Okay I got there. Um, one of these was a tiny bit bashed so I've opened the tiny bit bashed one. Keep the good one for you guys. Um, so as you can see, the packaging is just so cute. It's got this holographic heart and a little unicorn. And let's see what we've got inside. Please open. I'm having a fail opening boxes today. Um, these are only £5 each, by the way. And we see how much product you get in this. And I apparently still had some of that lime green shadow on my finger. <laughs> it came up onto the box. Um, do, do, do. So, heart shaped box, it's gold in the back. This is, looks so cute on your dresser. It's so shimmery and iridescent and holographic y, and I love it. And then inside we have this guy. So, oh, I'm just so excited to try this, both as a highlighter and as eyeshadows as well, because the strips are big enough, the striped strips of colour, whatever you want to call them, are big enough that you would be able to get a shadow brush into individual colours in there and uh, yeah so we've got a lavender stripe that let's do the forearm that's usually a bit better so very nice and subtle and then we have a baby blue uh, don't think that would go as a highlighter on its own but um, each to their own and um, we have green which obviously mix in with the rest of the highlighter is going to give a bit of colour correcting against redness. Uh, yellow, which is going to do the same sort of thing. And last but not least, we have a baby pink corner. Yeah. So that's going to be very brightening. And then obviously you swirl them all together and you just get a very icy highlight. Now, I do feel when I went swirly that I might have smudged the lines a little bit, but that's probably more because I'm using my finger. So, I'm going to have a full review of that. I shouldn't have swatched it. I'm kind of going into review territory. Um, but we'll try it on. We'll see how it wears. We'll see how it looks on the skin. Um, so yeah, so that is everything that I bought. I think I got so much for the money. Um, and then we have the mystery bag. Now supposedly this has about £25 worth of products in it so let's see what we have and again everything in here is bubble wrapped so really nice and secure <laughs> oh 
Oh my god, there's so many things in here. Okay, I oh I don't even know where to start with this. Okay, let's just start with the first thing that kind of fell. So in fact, I'm gonna go wash my hands. Okay, so we're back, we are clean, we are ready to resume this swatch fest. So first up I have got the Makeup Revolution Salvation Intense Lip Lacquer. Um very nice packaging, kind of rose gold. And it's bright red, which is very me. I love me some red. Ooh. Da, da, da. And we have a doe foot applicator. Oh, that's, that is nice. It's super, super creamy and pigmented. That's going to be so nice. Now, I don't really know much about this product. Um, high shine, long lasting gloss. So it's not a liquid lipstick that's going to dry down but that colour is glorious. Um, we also have a lip gloss tube, pink with like a blue duochrome reflex to it. Um, ooh. I think almost all of this is Makeup Revolution actually. Um, they do do other brands but uh, eh. Oh that's so pretty and iridescent. And it's got a slight sweet smell, which is fine by me. And we have... What are you? High Shine Long Lasting Lip Hug, Lip Hug Lipstick. End with Beginnings? That's such an unusual name. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, it looks like it's a, a bright pink. Oh, it's a really bright pink. Wow, okay. Okay, it's a bit sheer, so that's going to be really pretty. Um, I think if that had been like a pigmented cream lipstick, it might have been a little bit scary for me. But that looks like it's going to be really pretty. And it felt really smooth going on. And then we have an I Love Makeup Lipstick, um, which is the same brand as the Unicorn Highlighter. Um, I haven't really tried anything from that brand, um, although I've been hunting for that Unicorn Highlighter for weeks and then just gave up and bought it online. Um, so again, this is a pink, oh look, it's love heart and it's like a core in the middle of it. It's a very sheer colour, but again, that's probably going to be really cute and pretty and it's called Heart is Pumping. <laughs> love the names, don't know where they're getting them from. Um, we also have a Makeup Revolution Pure Pigment which is in a brown shade. Now, I'm not big on browns, so I'm going to leave that sealed um, in case somebody else wants it. We have one of these single eyeshadows for Makeup Revolution in Dirty Cash, which is a kind of olivey brown. A little bit similar to the one that was in that pack. Oh, no. Much more brown in real life, but that's going to be really pretty. Um, buffed out all over the eye even. I think that would be such a nice look. Um, these eyeshadows from memory are a pound. I have two of them and I love them. In fact, I had two of them. I used one of them up. Um, which shows you how much I love them. Um, dun, dun, okay. Alright, so we also have... Oh, the One Foundation in shade 15. Um, I'm going to take a wild guess from the box that this is not my shade. <laughs> at all. Um, let's, let's see, oh definitely not my shade. Wee! Um, wrong end of the spectrum guys. Um, yeah. <laughs> Maybe not. We also have the one blush stick in matte rush. These boxes don't want to open for me today. I'm having such a Ah, uh, so, da, da, da. ooh, a nice orangey, very orange actually, coral colour, and we've moved on to the second hand, so let's, ooh. oh, wow, that's, okay, do not apply straight from the stick, how much does this sheer out, okay, sheared out, it's going to be quite pretty, um, but yeah, do not apply it straight from the stick, we have learned that today together. Uh, we also have one of the Radiant Lights Glow. Ooh. Duh. 
Ooh, might be a tad dark for me, but let's have a look. It's very, very goldy, but it feels very silky. Um, I may have to see if some of my friends would want this. So, overall, wow. Um, as a free gift, I think that stuff is amazing. I think putting things like foundation into a free gift is a little bit odd, because you need to know somebody's skin tone before you can give them foundation. Clearly, that is not my skin tone. Um, but in terms of like the range and the quality of products, I'm really, really delighted with that as a free gift. In terms of what I bought, oh my god, so excited. Um, so if you guys would like to see any other videos relating to any of this stuff, whether it's a review, whether it's a get ready with me focusing on any of those palettes, let me know down below and I will get back to you. But for just now, I am going to go and wash my hands and see if I can find anybody who's the skin tone. <laughs> because I live in Scotland and most of my friends are quite pasty like me. So, yeah. Hmm. But oh, this is still my star buy. I'm in love. I love it. Right, actually gonna go. Um, catch you guys later. Bye.